Hello everyone. Today we've got Bolt Action by Alan Lunsford. I have not solved any of his puzzles yet. I've got a few of them on the shelf. Um, this one, I don't know, this one seemed the most interesting to get started with. And so that's where I'm going to start. And see what the goal is. Remove the coin and find a reason to smile. That's a two-part objective right there. You can see the coin. Do you need a reason to smile? We're gonna find one. No external tools, no excessive force, no hard hits. Store below 100 degrees Fahrenheit. I think I've been doing that. Contains magnetic components. Have fun. Don't tell me what to do, Alan. You're not the boss. Anyway, let's start this guy. Okay, so like I said, I have a couple of his puzzles. There's a series of three coin release called uh, Cop Out, I believe. Um, then there's two that look very similar to this one, same form factor. But I haven't solved any of them, so I don't know much about how these things typically go. I can see there's a long rod or pen going this way. Let me see if the coin moves. Coin can move a tiny bit. You got this gap here, a slot. Big enough for that quarter. That sounded like something moved a lot. Um, that's still there. We got a hole, a hole. All right, how do I get started with this thing? All right, can I just take this off? I don't, <laughs> I kind of assumed I would need a tool to remove that, but it just unscrews. Oh, okay. So we've got this. Let's just put it in various places. See what happens. Doesn't fit in there. Oh, I pushed this down. So where did that come from? What? Is that in here? Oh boy. Okay, I've got another one. screw this in here. Cannot pull or push just yet. But obviously, oh, here we go. Let's see I'm pushing this open. I see something there. Thought that was another rod that'll come out, but maybe not. Hold that in place. Take this out. Focus, please. It was threaded. Oh. I don't know what I'm doing, but it's something. Here every every about half turn there's that click. Can't really push it or pull it. Just keep going. I don't think it's going any further in. Can't tell what it's doing. I'm 
Now it's kind of stuck. Oh, there we go. Okay, we're coming up. Uh, I'll just let it go. Oh, it looks like there's another pen in here. There's something here. It looks like it's blocking a pen that goes up and down, I think. Can I pry that open? It looks like I did open it. Okay, I don't know, I don't, I don't know if screwing this did anything, or if that was just kind of always there and I didn't notice. So we're getting longer and longer bolts. So I think the last step to get the coin out is going to be to, oh wait, look at that. So this has a magnet in it, so I can pull this. Oh, <laughs> maybe not. I could pull it. No, it's back. I can shake it over. What does that do for me? I just swore it was stuck to the bolt. So there's two pieces here, right? somehow have to get those apart one this one goes this way that one goes that way and then maybe the coin can come out so if there's a magnet can I just pull them away from each other. See that? I'm not crazy. Like it sticks to it sometimes, but only ever so slightly. And I can't get it to do it now. There are holes in it? I'm silly. Of course there's a hole in this one. There are holes in both. I'm the silliest. Maybe I just have to screw this in to both. Then pull it apart. Easy peasy. Alright, we've got a quarter. Ha. Okay. So remove the coin find a reason to smile I assume it'll be something obvious hey the coin quarter does not fit there at all so this is where the quarter was seems like I can look that moves a little bit a little opening there. Now it's gone. Yeah, that's not opening wide enough to get a screw in there. <laughs> oh, that just popped out. I'm gonna have to put this thing back together, aren't I? So now... Oh my gosh, wait. What in the world is happening? Oh my gosh. This is a disaster. I don't want all this to come out. Alright. So, we have a new longer bolt. thinking like we still haven't used this and I swear this is the longest one right like this looks like a little bolt action -y. you know you pull the bolt back 
load a new round in the chamber. <laughs> oh, that's so stupid. Oh, I can't recreate it. Look at this. It's a smiley face guy, but... Ah. Oh, now I can't get it back. There we go. I had to put it real far back. Look at that. Oh, man. I do have a big smile on my face right now. <laughs> I was just about to say, like, why can't I get this over here? Then as soon as I get it over, it kind of pulled forward and out comes this ridiculous smiley. Okay. All right. That was fun. That was, that was a little challenging. I gotta be honest, I'm a little annoyed by this thing up here. I don't know if it just does nothing, or if I did use it and didn't realize it. Let's try to let's try to get it reset and maybe that'll help see. be closed closed I don't know how or why I kind of don't like that I don't know but it's okay and in 58 minutes we have it solved and reset that was really good. So, basically an hour. I don't really know what's going on here with screwing this and... I don't know. Not sure what's happening. Everything else I think I understand. Uh, but that's okay. So we're moving the coin. And then finding the reason to smile. Yeah, this was a lot of, a lot of fun. Good work, Alan Lunsford. Um... He's got more puzzles on the way, and I'm gonna be sure to try to pick up uh, pick up any future Lunsford puzzles I can find. Uh, I'll leave a link in the description. He's, he sells them on Etsy. His shop is uh, Layer by Layer Puzzles. Choo. But I'll leave a link. All right. We'll see what puzzle we do next time. And as always, thanks for watching.